In Trump legal news, the Supreme Court has declined to delay Trump's sentencing in his conviction for the New York election interference case, which means on September 18th, he's scheduled to be sentenced. Now, in D.C., Judge Chuckin, regarding his January 6th case, has denied his motion to dismiss and told the parties to appear in front of her on August 16th. This will be the first time the parties have appeared in front of her in seven months because of the Supreme Court delay. We'll expect to hear a briefing schedule and possible evidentiary hearing schedule then. Now, Jenna Ellis in Arizona, a Trump attorney has agreed to cooperate with Arizona's attempt to hold the fake electors accountable for their participation in the 2020 scheme. Now, out in Georgia, the election board there, which comprised of Trump election deniers, have changed the rules regarding county certification of the vote, which I talked about in my TikTok last week. Now, they have managed to change the rule, which means that now it is allowed to have a reasonable inquiry before they certify, whereas before they really just had a duty to certify and was considered an administrative task. Now, Michigan has opened a criminal investigation into Elon Musk's pack for what they appear to be collecting data instead of actually sending people to sites to register to vote. 